Hello and welcome to Web Applications for Everybody. In this presentation, we're going to talk about how to submit your assignment to an auto grader. Now, we don't use the auto grader until later in the course. And in the first assignment, this guessing game assignment in this course, we have a lot of documentation about how to use the auto grader. And so the idea of the auto grader is that you're going to submit your running application to the auto grader. And the auto grader is going to send requests to your application and look at the responses. The problem is, is if you've got your application running on your local host, which is the way you uh, are doing that, um, you can't simply pass this local host value into the running applications. Okay, because localhost is a very special address and localhost only works from the browser that's running on your computer talking to the server that's running on your computer. So localhost is not sort of an external address. And so we have to temporarily give your server an external address. Now normally your server is firewalled away from incoming connections. And so we have to kind of break an opening through the firewall. And there's a couple of different uh, applications that can do this. One of them is called NGROC and one of them is called Local Tunnel. In this video I'm going to demonstrate uh, the use of Local Tunnel. So your Local Tunnel is a, a little weird in that um, Local Tunnel is a little hard to install. Okay, so here's the Local Tunnel website. You're welcome to use this website, but this NPM stuff on your computer, you might, it's hard to get to the point where NPM is working. If you're a already a sophisticated web developer and you have NPM, which is the Node Package Manager, then fine, this is really great and this is really easy. So this makes sense to you. But I'm expecting that most of you are not going to know how to, uh, not going to want to uh, run it. And so I built a local tunnel for Macintosh that makes it so that it's a sort of a single click install. So here we go. I'm going to uh, click on this and it's going to download this zip file. And I'm going to show this in the finder. So here we go, and I'm going to double click on the Macintosh document. And so this is unexecutable. So I'm going to put that in the downloads folder. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to run a terminal program. And I am going to go into my desktop. I'm going to do an LS and, um, oh, not desktop, downloads. So my downloads, do my LS. It's always good to do an LS to make sure you're in the right spot. Here's the LT Mac file that I just downloaded. And so what I'm going to do is just run this command dot slash LT Mac minus port 8888. And so it just happens that my MAMP runs on port 8088 locally. And what this is going to do is this is going to copy uh, everything on port 8088 out to the internet and give us a temporary uh, domain name. So this domain name is really important. And so I can basically take this URL and re just replace a localhost 8080. You don't have to put the 8088 on because it's actually taken the port as well. And so now I have this slash WA free solutions guest guest PHP. And now I can hit this. Now this is the exact same thing. It's really my local URL, but it's my stuff running on my server. It's just it has a temporary domain name just long enough for you to turn in your assignment. Okay. So then what you do is you copy this. First, you want to get it working like this in your browser and make sure that it comes back with the page you expect to come back to. Because if it doesn't work here, it's not going to hurt work here with the auto grader. Now, this is particularly solution and I'm supposed to make my, my right answer be 50. And so this auto grader is not going to work very well. Okay, it's going to give me full credit. And so it's trying to find some things and it's telling me with these toggles, you can always look and see what it's complaining about, see the pages. And so even if I made all kinds of mistakes, 72% with all these mistakes. And so that ought, that went ba right back into my assignments. And so uh, uh, away we go. And so that basically uh, summarizes how we use local tunnel. You can also use NGROC, but how we use local tunnel to submit running applications to the auto grader.